we've all felt it. That feeling of being a talking head in a box. Speaking to a wall of black tiles. Asking a question, and all you hear is crickets and tumbleweeds. Or oh, more likely, silence. We've all had the feeling of coming out of a meeting and feeling drained instead of energized. It even has a name. Zoom fatigue. It is so hard to be engaged when you're sitting in a video call to lean in. And it's even harder when you're the one that's trying to engage people. If you've ever tried to host a brainstorm or even a meeting remotely, you'll know that feeling. Or if you've thought, oh yes, we need to go back to the office because that is the only real way to collaborate. My co-founders and I felt this uh, when we, during the early days of COVID, did facilitated workshops over Zoom. They were not at all engaging. They sucked. In spite of having done hundreds of workshops in person before, we were not able to engage people. Oh, and, and we tried. We sent out mirror links, opened up Mentimeter, did tons of polls. But, and it kind of helped, but it also took the tons of effort and took the focus away from the participants. Workshops are not the only collaborative sessions that suffer from this. Some teams have thought, yeah, we, then we need to go all in asynchronous, never meeting up, saying that meetings are a waste of time. That should not be the case. Async collaboration should not be the only way to collaborate. We should be able to collaborate together at the same time. That's what we're enabling with Butter. Butter is a video conferencing tool built for collaboration. We think there are three things necessary for successful collaborative sessions. Firstly, sessions should be structured. You should structure a session up front with a clear agenda, outcomes defined, roles of participants. Uh, but with many call tools, the call starts when it starts. If you're lucky, the host will have defined an agenda, maybe even defined outcomes and takeaways, but more often not. In Butter, you're able to prepare your sessions ahead of time, plan a full agenda, and know exactly how you want to break the ice with people and also prepare your best bag of tools and tricks so you're ready regardless of how the session progresses. And if you need a bit of help with the structuring, you can use pre-built agenda templates from top facilitators. This allows you to focus on the session and the participants when it's taking place. Secondly, structure is useless if sessions are not engaging. In many tools, engagement is limited to, you know, a little emoji in the top right-hand side of your tile. And a lot of ways to collaborate is limited to simply speaking up in a room full of people. We believe people should be able to engage in many different ways, such as showing your excitement with a big fire emoji, or pinning your choice on a deck of cards, and engage through GIFs in chat. And if you do need to speak, then you should be able to simply pop yourself into the queue and you'll be up next. And sometimes you need something loud to cut through the roar. Therefore, sound effects. <laughs> Thirdly, collaborative sessions should be simple. No more tool overload. 
No more sending out random links. No more worrying about whether you're all seeing the same thing. In Butter, it's all just there, all in one interface. Super straightforward. Whether you're pumping up the energy with a cool YouTube video, writing about the next big thing in Google Docs, or brainstorming about an awesome slush presentation in Miro, it's all there, all in one interface. Everyone collaborating together without confusion. Butter also allows you to basically prepare the session before the session starts, run the session during the session, creating high energy and engagement, and support you after the session by allowing you to export outcomes, takeaways, and of course, a nice recording. This has proven quite successful. We've got companies like Webflow, Canva, Kraft Heinz, and DreamWorks running their internal workshops on Butter, along with a very long list of agencies and consultancies. And of course, we're dogfooding Butter ourselves every day with our remote team of 20 people across 10 different countries. And we believe this is just the beginning. Remote work is still in its infancy. Every week, we are seeing dozens of companies announce that they're going fully remote. And loads of startups start out as remote from day one. We believe that synchronous collaboration is one of the last big barriers to remote work. And with Butter, we aim at solving this problem. And we believe that by allowing complex collaboration to take place, we'll enable a new remote-first era. And we'll not settle for anything less than that. <laughs>